Hello everyone, this is Ashwani Parekh. Today I am going to show you how to make this vertex in a quirky way. So I have previously made this vertex. Um, it's kind of boring but uh, exciting also. Not exciting, a little bit dull because it's only two to black and white. So um, let's make it a little interesting. Uh, let's create one more artwork. Delete it. I need two circles for this. So one, let's make it like this, and another one, a uh, smaller one. Okay, perfect. Now uh, select this port and press Ctrl Alt B. This is a short key or blend tool. And now reduce these steps because we do need gapping, gapping between two circles. Okay. Now uh, let's go. Uh, Keep it in top and make one more circle. Press Ctrl uh, Shift X to show its outline. Uh, delete this both anchor so that we can get a nice arc. Mm, increase its size. Now select this both object. Now go to object. Blend replace spine so now um, we'll have we'll take a rectangle press M M for rectangle and hold shift so that we can get equal spacing okay now show you the rectangle now duplicate this okay and uh, rotate this object join this anchors if you're facing this problem then go to outline mode zoom it and do it manually yep perfect outline mode is control y now delete this rectangle and select this both spines and control c control f copy and place in the same place now rotate this so that you can get a nice buffering kind of thing and so the main surprise is uh, here go to object blend expand what will it do it will uh, uh, it will transform spine into a solid object now we can edit its property go to gradient and apply gradient over here okay do it like this this is perfect and what we'll do we will add a background in this Let's take a simple background. Yep. Send it backwards. See, uh, we are merging this thing. So this is a nice. This will give us the nice depth feature. Now select this. Go to Windows. Sorry, my bad. But then go to effect distort transform transform but before that uh, do see that this thing is grouped okay 
grouped is gone as a control G. Okay, so now go to effect, distort and transform. Transform. Now copies make it make copies of thirty or whatever. You can experiment it according to you. Okay, scale it like this so that you can get a, a oval kind of thing. Keep in mind that um, you should keep this both values same so that you can get a nice circle, perfect circle kind of thing. Now let's change its angle. You can get this nice cyclonic, cyclonic vortex kind of thing. Now hit OK. Now voila. What is ready? So, thank you so much. Do like, comment, and do subscribe. Thank you so much.